वेलकम टू केमिस्ट्री लाभार एंड आवर टू डेज रिविसन कोश्चन इज फ्रम जून टू थाउजेंड फोरटीन नाउ दिस कोश्चन इज नट अ डिफिकल्ट वन बट एट द सेम टाइम देर इज ए चान्स दैट यू कैन डू मिसटेक उइथ दिस प्रब्लेम एंड दैट्स वाई आई एम डिसकसिंग दिस वन उथ यू नो यू कैन सी दिस इज द प्रब्लेम गिवेन सो दिस इज अ ट्राई इन एंड इट इज रियक्टेड उथ दिस एलकाइन इन प्रेजेंस अफ हिट सो व्हाट उल बी द प्रोडक्ट now the mistake which you can do uh, when solving this question is that these two options are looking so attractive that you can pick one of them but it is actually wrong why it is wrong because here the cycloaddition reaction between these two partners is not a favorable one because it is you can see it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 and this is 1 2 so it is a 6 plus 2 this this would be a 6 plus 2 cyclo addition reaction that is a uh, total of 8 electron which is a 4n pi electron and this is so if it is a 4n pi electron that means the suprafacial reaction is this not allowed actually i cannot say this favor it is not allowed by the uh udward hopman rule so if udward hopman rule doesn't permit this uh 4n pi electron in suprafacial manner then it should go in the antrafacial pathway now this product it is the product of a suprafacial addition and that's why it cannot be the correct option this d it can come either from this or it may also come from the antrafacial uh, reaction but in this system the antrafacial addition is geometrically or sterically not valid because you can see this is a rigid system and here the antrafacial uh, addition or antrafacial cycloaddition is not favored so this d option will also not be correct now uh, so what will be the option what will be the reaction or what will be the fate of this so if you just forget this one and you think of this compound in presence of heat so what will happen so it is basically it can undergo a uh, electrocyclic ring closing because you can see this is a 1 2 3 4 5 6 so is it is a six membered electrocyclic ring closing reaction like this okay so six membered electrocyclic ring closing and that will give you in presence of heat so it will be disrotatory in presence of heat it is 6n pi electron so it will be disrotatory so if here you have one hydrogen here you have one hydrogen and if it is disrotation so if both hydrogen go in this direction what you will get so basically you will get the two hydrogens in the same side so now you can see so it is basically six member ring and here so both hydrogen can go above the plane or they can go below the plane that doesn't matter but both are in the same side and this so this this will form first you can see both in the options both hydrogen are in the same side so for this step there uh, shouldn't be any confusion with the stereochemistry now let us come to the second step in the second step you have this one this alkyne so now you can see it is a dienophile and it is a diene so now usual uh, it is a 4n plus uh, sorry 4 plus 2 or 6 pi electron it is a diels alder reaction and diels alder reaction between these two partners will give you so can give you either product a or product b now you have to decide between product a and b how you can decide so here you can see this oxygen is below the plane so if the oxygen is below the plane this this part this dienophile part will come from above the plane right so whether this oxygen is below the plane or above the plane that doesn't matter but this dienophile will come from the opposite direction of this oxygen and in option a you can see this oxygen this is below the plane because this hydrogen is above the plane and this one is above the plane so here the oxygen and this uh dienophile partner they are in the opposite direction whereas in product c they are in the same direction this is exo you can see 
uh, sorry this is endo but here it is exo so they two are in the opposite side so this option a will be the correct answer so we, you don't have to uh, write down whole mechanism nothing you have to look into the options carefully and that's how you have to solve the questions in the in the csr net exam i hope that this video will uh, help you in your preparation for the upcoming csr net exam thank you for watching and if you want more videos like that you can go through the uh, playlist of my channel the playlist name is revision question for the csr net exam june 2019 you will get at least five six questions like this and uh, more interesting than this so that questions will surely help you